plastic stain. Hi, hello there. So today I'm gonna talk about my current favorite curling method, and it is hot rollers. So easy to do, quick and simple, you know. So when you're putting on your makeup, you can just unroll it after, and yeah. So let's get started. What I did first was wash my hair with, um, ah, sorry, my texting, uh, with the organic shampoo. It thickens my hair. Then I'm just gonna spread some hairspray all over the place. Um, just a really thin layer would be good, and just brush it out right away so that it doesn't get all um, knotty and you know a big mess. You want it in your hair so it can keep your curls nice and curly. Now I'm going to tease my hair in the crown area, just the top half of my head, and this is definitely optional, you don't have to do it, but as you can see, I have very fine and thin hair, so it is what I usually prefer to do when I go out. Alright, so now that my rollers are all nice and hot, I'm going to do um, the largest rollers for my top uh, crown area and I'm just gonna roll it onto my hair. I usually do like halfway and then roll the ends onto it and then I roll like the whole section um, close to my scalp and just take the clip and clip it into place. And that's basically it. You're gonna repeat this once more with a large roller. Alright, so after that, I'm going to take the smaller size, so it's the second um, biggest in the bunch, and do the rest of my hair. I'm going to do it just a roll down the middle of my head. Okay, now the next couple sections are going to be vertical instead of the horizontal um, sections compared to before. So the rollers are going to be away from your face and you know just kind of follow the technique of wrapping it halfway and then wrapping the rest against your scalp and clip it in place. I knew I wouldn't forget you, so I went and let you blow my mind. So usually I would be doing makeup right now, but since for the purpose of this video I have makeup on already, so yeah, I just looked at my computer anyways. So when the rollers feel cool to the touch, I just remove them and you have your curls. I'm doing this for my birthday and I want the curls to last all day long, all night long or whatever. I'm just going to do a layer of my favorite hairspray, Aussie Instant Freeze hairspray. It's like extreme hold so the curls will stay on a long time. I'm going to kind of brush everything really lightly and um, tease my crown section again. You don't have to do this if you don't want to but I like big hair so I will. So the method is just like um, a section, you spray, you tease, a section, you spray, your tease, and then kind of brush it gently on top to smooth the hair out. For this hairstyle, I have been doing a side parting. It's just what I prefer. You can do whatever parting you want. Now I'm doing my bangs. If you want to watch it, go ahead. It's just a little demonstration of how I mold it and stuff. So it might be boring. Now with the rest of the hair, I kind of like to like pull them apart so it looks more natural. And um, I like to do like a little bit of teasing in the inner um, curls so that the curls look larger and fuller and my hair just looks thicker because again I have thin hair. You don't have to do this if your hair is super thick and you know, not like mine. But here is the final look. You can also do like side ponytails and back ponytails or whatever you want and I think it looks super cute also. So those are a couple other ideas, um, but I love these curls. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Follow me on Instagram. I just got one, and I think that's it. Oh, I have some birthday pictures after this for you guys, and I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye. Who's one of my
time.